Ynet Technology, a broadband company as a network service provider, has become the first company to sign an agreement with Telecom Malaysia or TM to use TM's high-speed broadband or HSBB infrastructure to provide wireless internet services. TM's Group Chief Operating Officer, Datuk Adnan Rofi'i, says the agreement is an encouraging sign as Ynet, although fully licensed to set up its own infrastructure, has decided to subscribe to TM's service and infrastructure. Uh, we will be providing the uh, backbone, backbone network, which is basically to connect all their nodes, I mean, for them to uh, provide the wireless uh, Ynet CEO Lee Wai Tak agrees and explained that the agreement saves time and is cheaper for Ynet because the five-year agreement is priced at only 250 million ringgit. It will take us maybe we have uh, in our projection it will take us another three to five years for us to have our infra I mean uh, nationwide from the north to the south, and if we were to write on TM, so we can write uh, on it overnight. So the solution being that we are working closely with TM instead of to. And cost-wise, uh, Dato mentioned 50 million a year. Is that, is that cheaper than building your own network? Uh, apparently, yes. Under the agreement, Ynet will leverage on TM's existing wholesale internet service and its HSBB network, enabling its Ynet broadband services to be rolled out to more than 4,500 base stations within the next five years. Ynet hopes to roll out its wireless internet services by the third quarter of this year, aiming to reach 1 million users within its five years of operations. Currently, Ynet's broadband service is available at more than 100 locations, including Kulim, Sungai Petani, Kangar and Taiping. Our operation centre is in North, so it's easier for us to do our trial, to do our testing. But once we open up nationwide, we'll be at hubs at every region. We are targeting to open five new hubs in how, Malaysia. How, I mean, how... Speaking to reporters after the signing ceremony between TM and Ynet, Lee says Ynet intends to invest 1 billion ringgit raised through private equities and commercial banks to roll out its services including voice, data and multimedia services. Lee explains that Ynet decided to use Wi-Fi technology as WiMAX is still a new technology in the market and not many devices uses the WiMAX technology. He says that Wi-Fi technology will still be dominant in the foreseeable future as it has already been established for a much longer period compared to WiMAX. TM's wholesale internet provides cost-effective, robust, scalable and seamless connectivity solutions offering high-speed secure connectivity access based on carrier class internet industry standards across a metropolitan area network extending to multiple locations nationwide.